I was the first peer support worker recruited. And ever since then, my life has been absolutely lifted. I feel very positive, very useful, uh, very rewarded by the work I do. I do uh, lots of conferences, lots of talking to psychiatrists, lots of talking to different people that are concerned with dementia. So I work with people with early diagnosis and it's good because at least I can tell them, you know, it's, it's a scary. Some people make it look like it's scary. It's not scary. You just have to look after yourself. I'm called an honorary peer support worker, which I'm deeply impressed about and don't quite understand. And, um, uh, and so again, like the, uh, my, my compatriots, um, I, I got quite depressed about the whole thing, but I find being in this environment and with all the people working on this kind of health, that it, it does a tremendous amount for one's general well-being and mind and everything. And it's so supportive. It's just absolutely wonderful. I'm learning to cope with it. You know, it, it's not the end of my life. I struggle. Like, don't get me wrong. I, I do struggle with my words. And, and the, the memory is just frustrating sometimes. There is life with dementia. There's lots of life left. I make myself be very positive. I make myself be cheerful. Some people know how to cope and deal with other people with it. But for me, I try to make it easy. I, 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 you know, my family understand because I talk to them, you know, and I, I talk to, I go to church, so I, I explain to them, you know, the bits and pieces that are going on. You know, they don't put pressure on me. If I feel that it's too much pressure, then I would say that it's too much pressure. And then I would walk away or step down from what I'm supposed to do, but I would still get involved. Um, I certainly don't want to die left yet. I, I, I'm not young by any means. But I want to go on living as long as I can because it's just wonderful to be alive. Take care of yourself because you can have it for a long time and you don't go down the drain. Just look after yourself. Eat healthy. Do exercise. Do lots of group walks. There are lots of group walks that they have in the community. My advice is not to live inside yourself, mm. but to live outside yourself. Mm. Be adventurous, stretch your mind. Don't think because you've got dementia that you've got to uh, curl up and mm. live in a shell. Stretch out and be happy. Do things, uh, all sorts of things. Even if you just go and walk in the park and notice mm. the trees and notice the flowers and notice the people, just do anything that you like doing. Be happy. Mm. Tell yourself, I will be positive. I will be happy. Mm. Tell yourself that every day, and you will be. Mm. Mm.